let's pray. Father and our God, we come before you, God, saying thank you. Lord, I pray as you are going to start, be with us. Even Lord, I pray, let us start well and finish well. There is none like you, God. Even I pray, as you are going to start, be with us and end with us. It is in Jesus' name, Lord, I pray. Amen. Happy, happy, happy Easter. Boys and girls, welcome back to our game show. We all left off at the scene of crucifixion, where the Lord Jesus Christ was nailed to a cross. So, contestants, tell us what happened next. When Jesus died, the earth shook, the sun stopped shining. The curtains in the temple tore into two, from top to bottom. The soldier at the cross realized that Jesus was truly the Son of God. Many of the Lord's disciples feared and ran away for their lives. Joseph of Arimathea asked Pilate permission to bury Jesus. So they took his body and buried it in a tomb. Overwhelmed with sorrow, shame, and the fear of losing their lives, the Lord's disciples and his closest friends hid themselves in a room. So, contestants, tell me the account for that day. Early on the first day of the week, the women had prepared spices and ran to the tomb. On arrival, they saw the stone had rolled away. Angels appeared to the women and announced to them, that Christ had risen. Wow. Wow. They rushed back to let the disciples know, but they didn't believe the women. Peter and John ran to the tomb to see for themselves. They too saw the stone 
had been rolled and the Lord's burial clothes lying there just the way they had buried him. They all walked into the tomb and believed. Mary Magdalene stood outside the tomb, weeping, thinking that the Lord's body was stolen. But Jesus Christ appeared to her. Wow. And to the two disciples on the road to a mouse. And to the disciples who were hiding in a room. Hallelujah. He's risen. He's risen. Alive, alive, alive forevermore. Jesus is alive, alive forevermore. Alive, alive, alive forevermore. My Jesus is Jesus has paid it all. His life, death, and burial ushered in a new plan of salvation for mankind. Easter is not about colored Easter eggs or the Easter bunny. No, no, no it is not. Easter is about the crucifixion and the resurrection of Jesus Christ. Yes, it is. The only God and Savior of the world. Yes, he is. The true message of Easter proclaims the greatest act of love known to man. God's infinite love for each and every one of us. So, please let's welcome Hannah to share the great lessons that she learned during Easter. Imagine that. Today, we can speak to him directly. Imagine that. And today, we no longer separate from God. Imagine that. He has gone to prepare the best place in heaven for us. Imagine that. We have come to the end of our session, and I can't tell which contestant won. The love of Christ won. Imagine that. <laughs> Let me give you this opportunity to know this love of God. Accepting Jesus as your personal savior and believing in him as the only way to the Father. Let's bow down for a word of prayer. Lord Jesus, Lord Jesus I come before you. I, come before you. I, accept I accept that I am a sinner. Rub my name. In the book of death, write my name in the book of life. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Have you been to Jesus for the cleansing spa? Are you washing the blood of the Lamb? Are you fully trusting in His grace? Are you washed in the blood of the Lamb? Are you washed in the blood in the soul?
yote yalifunguliwa wakaonekana na watu wengi kwenye mji mtakatifu lakini Yesu aliyesulubi amefufuka Kononi na miguni mwa alama kubwa Uso uso wangara kama jua macho kama miale ya moto Mavazi yake meupe angaza kushinda chote kijulikana Oh Yesu Yesu aliyesulubi amefufu Macho kama miale ya moto Mamazi ye, mavazi ya keme upe ya ngaza Kushinda chote kijulika na chote